Our planet Earth is constantly changing, but it's changing faster and in more ways than ever before. Human-induced climate change is being experienced on a global, national, and even local level. One problem that will affect coastal areas, including Boston, is sea level rise. Many of the planet's highly populated areas are near the ocean, putting those places at increased risk of flooding. But how can we track the changes in sea level and predict future flooding events? Let's dive into the science and technology monitoring our oceans to understand what is happening. Our planet has a problem. We are continually pumping carbon dioxide, or CO2, into our atmosphere. As a greenhouse gas, CO2 traps heat, and that heat affects our oceans in two main ways. One, it melts ice caps at the poles, adding to the amount of water in the oceans. And two, the water absorbs the heat itself, and it expands adding to the amount of space that the oceans take up. Since the volume of water is increasing in our oceans, our oceans take up more space. They have nowhere to go but up, so sea levels are rising. We can monitor sea level rise not only at the coastal areas affected, but also by remote sensing, or the science of scanning the Earth from a distance, using technology like cameras on satellites or high-flying airplanes. Scientists compile data from at least 14 satellites or aircraft to determine changes in sea level across the globe. One NASA satellite that is vital to data collection around the oceans is AQUA which images ice melting, ocean currents, and much more. Those imaging data are essential for understanding how much our oceans have changed and for predicting how much oceans will continue to change. Approximately 40% of the world's population lives near the coast. So what is being done to prevent damage from sea level rise? Coastal areas are already preparing for increased flooding. Some cities are choosing to build up hard barriers on the shoreline, or even creating barriers like Venice, Italy is doing. Some are choosing increased grassy areas to absorb and redistribute floodwaters. Affected areas all over the world are taking different approaches to dealing with sea level rise, as every place will experience it differently. By understanding how much our sea level has changed from the past to now, and by using remote sensing data to predict future changes, we can become resilient. Humans have created amazing technology to prevent sea level rise from damaging coastal areas, and we will continue to innovate as we learn more.